have to go with the uh, you'll have to go with the flow. Ito ba yung we're saying that all throughout the pandemic, di ba? And you've been, um, can you tell us kung ano yung tinabisihan ninyo exactly? Like parang sino po yung mga tinitrain ninyo? Because we heard you were training Sparkle on this. Uh, uh, I was doing classes. I was doing Pinipining Pilipinas candidates. I trained uh, GMA7 artists. I had sessions with RISE artists. I had classes with a lot of beauty queens. Uh, at marami pang iba. Pangarap ko right now, sana matuloy. But we're working on creating uh, an academy for short courses. Nung, nung nakita ka nga po, Tito Boy, dun sa GMA, parang na, naisip talaga ng lahat na you'll be transferred. I, I, I really trained. Uh, I did talent management with... Uh, uh, the guys of uh, Tony Tuviera, a triple uh, A, ang daming ang daming trainings. I I did classes for schools. So uh, patuloy during during COVID, ang daming ginawa. Okay, there are four networks here. Hindi mo maiwan ng television. Hindi ko talaga maiwan. Um, na na miss ko talaga. I really miss doing television. Oh, yung pamamaraan ng paggawa ng palabas sa pamamagitan ng telebisyon ay kinasanayan ko at yun ang pamilyar ako at yun ang mahal ko and nagpapasalamat naman ako sa digital platforms na binigyan ako ng kwang na hindi ko talaga ini-expect Oo, hindi ko talaga ini-expect na tatanggapin ako doon sa pagsubok ko sa YouTube, Facebook TikTok 1.2 million subscribers 1.7 something. <laughs> Almost 1.8. I can't keep up. I can't keep up. Oh my. And it was so fast. Ataka katua, de ba? It was so fast. Manapaka bilis. And I'm doing just what I wanted to do, which was interviewing. Mm -mm. Uh -oh. mm -hmm. uh, evolution. I think we are discovering each one of us is discovering our role. Um dati kasi but may may good and bad, no? Uh dahil sa halimbawa doon sa point na parang kami yan eh, parang tayo yan eh like some people don't need us anymore to break a news to the public you post something on IG and yun na yun pero people are also discovering na iba pa rin yung meron so siguro ang kinalalagyan natin ngayon ay we are in search of defining who we are in the digital age but it's hard to define it because it's moving. Hindi siya static. Uh, ako doon ako nag enjoy kasi um, mahirap. Mahirap pero hindi ka pwedeng hindi ka pwedeng mag-insist doon sa iyong kinasanayan dahil mapapag-iwanan ka. Ilang percentage ka ng tagging? Nagamit ko kasi yung training ko rin sa television. Marunong ako mag-edit. Uh, marunong ako mag-transcribe, marunong ako... Oh, mar mar kasi naalala niyo ba nung tayo yung nag-uumpisa, Mario? Pag lumalabas ka to do a story, MJ, kasama mo ang researcher, kasama mo ang writer, kasama mo ang segment producer, at kasama mo ang nag interview That was a team, no? Hindi yung aantayin mo lang ang transcription, tapos uh, ibabase ang edit doon sa transcription, hindi eh. Kailangan, alam mo yung, you know, you know the spirit of the story, of the interview, the sensibilities, uh, alam mo kung saan umiyak, saan nagalit, saan hindi sumagot. Uh -huh. eh, hindi na, ang iba niyan, hindi napapagkwentuhan. Eh. Ang maganda naman sa ano, ang maganda sa digital, which I discovered, napaka-immediate ng response. Napaka-immediate. Hindi ko sinasabi lahat, uh, lahat may katuturan. Pero somehow, ma, you'll get the sense eh, of uh, what you did. Ay, boy, hmm. magaling sa amin ito. Na, the sense namin na uh, your, your tone, na ba? Uh, between staying and moving on. Uh, that, that, that's not easy. Tama ka. That's not easy. 
that's not an easy decision. As of now, as I talk, hindi talaga madali. Hindi talaga madali. And hindi ako nagsisinungaling doon sa, hindi ko pa alam. Uh, uh, pero maganda dahil I will make sure I don't burn bridges kung sakasakali. Matuloy man o hindi, kung saan man ako, TV5 kung, or 7 or uh, kung ano pa ang mga stasyon. I, I, I will make sure na makikipag-usap ako ng matino. Ikakarify lang namin may humaharang. Hindi man. Humaharang or uh, nagdi-discourage sa'yo? Hindi. I value relationships, Mario. That makes this whole process difficult. Uh, that makes this process difficult. Nag-umpisa ako ng karera ko sa television sa Channel 7. Uh, parati ko sinasabi doon ako natuto maglakad. Natuto ako lumipad sa ABS-CBN. At ang sa dami ng tulong ng marami, I didn't do this thing alone. Mahirap dahil uh, may mga relasyon akong pinangangalagaan. Tito ba yan i-consider mo of Transpring para dun sa network? Ano yung ibibigay sa yung offer para dun ka mag-sign sa kanila? Yung nauunawaan kung nasaan ako. Kasi hindi naman ako 20 years old. <laughs> Oo. Di ba? I mean, I'm not starting a career in television. I've been doing this for like, kasing tagal niyo rin. <laughs> Magkakaibigan tayo. Malapit ako malaos. <laughs> hindi pa. No? King of talk? Hindi naman. I mean, let's be very honest. I mean, for lack of a better word, uh, all of us go. Uh, if there is one immutable law in the business, it is that nothing lasts forever. So I'm at that stage where I want to go back to where I want to be able to do what I do best. Importante sa akin yun. Kung magkakaroon ka ng ano, talk show, Tito Boy, you want, talk show. you want solo or you want me? Wala naman. Show? I mean, oh, pag-uusapan natin yun, yung mga detalye yun. But I want to be able to do my talk shows. I want to be able to do interviews. I want to be able to to do what I used to do, what I've been doing in the last so, 30 years. Tito Boy, medyo natanong ko na to sa'yo kanina bago mm -hmm. yung press con. Pero yun nga, kasi ngayon nga, maiksi na yung attention pa ng mga tao. Iba na rin yung audience. Like, anong klaseng broadcast ang ibibigay mo? We will discover that. Really Pero ganun din naman, MJ, kasi ang problema noon eh. Mm -hmm. Nung dumating ang television at radyo, uh, that was the same concern. Na parang ang radyo ay walang, walang video, walang, uh, walang nakikita. Pagdating ng television, ay mamamatay na ang radio. It survived. Uh -huh. It found a niche. Kaya nga nagkaroon tayo ng mga radio station na uh, which is keep on playing music forever, mm -hmm. which television could not do. Mm -hmm. So what I'm trying to say is, uh, we will discover ano ang nagagawa ng television, ano ang hindi nagag ang nagagawa ng digital. I, I think we will be we will be in a lifetime where we will be seeing co coexistence among all. Hindi ito yung papatay ng sa hindi ako naniniwala. Hindi ako naniniwala. Uh, how do you still mix celebrities uh, and trust with their stories despite the connection you, you, you don't build that in a day. Palagay ko, Mario knows this, Anna knows this, na ang tiwala ng celebrities, tinitingnan yung body of work mo, tinitingnan yung uh, trabaho mo, tinitingnan yung ginawa mo in the past. So, uh, yun. Uh, I, I, I don't think you, you say I am credible and people are supposed to believe in your credibility. It, it, it's your body of work. It's who you are. Uh, karakter ang pinag-uusapan natin dito. And if you're a celebrity, for example, what do you think yung kumbaga makakuha nila if I go to Boyabunda and talk about you know, issues as opposed to... I listen, and I'm fair. Hindi ako umuupo sa harap ng kahit sino with the intent of whatever it is. To malign, to demean, wala. Nakikinig ako sa kwento. Nakikinig ako sa kwento. At iginagalan ko ang kwento. Kuya, ba? May kapaboy din na yung interview? Sa Pilipinas? Pero kung magkakaroon ka ng first talk show sa TV, Tito Boy, sino yung gustong-gustong una mong ma-interview? Marami nangyayari ng pandemic, like Ate Guy, di ba? Nag-national artist, mga ganyan. Hindi ko alam. But I'll tell you something. Hindi ko alam kung pwede na ito sabihin. I am... Hindi ko alam, but... 
V is doing a 60th anniversary in show business. Tama ba ako? Mm. Tama ba ako? Good, I'm good, doing good, her good, interview. Good. And I am excited. Sa YouTube niya pa? Ne. Ah, wow, wow. You pala yung pilot. Pilot ba yun? No, no, no. Pilot episode. Pilot episode. Chip Guerrero. No, but I'm excited about it. I am doing, I am doing Miss Vilma Santos. I've done V many times. But this this one is different, di ba? Parang looking back at her body of work in the last 60 years. Gana pero... Okay. Oh, okay. I will interview si Ate Gay anytime. Mm -mm. As a national artist. Yes, I will do it. Alam niyo naman eh, uh -oh. nananalay tayo sa aking dugo ang pagiging dura niya. <laughs> Pero sobrang respeto ko kay Vilma Santos. First question niyo po sa kanya, kung sakaling... Uh, Kanino? Kay Ate, Ate Gay? Gay. Uh, Kumusta ka? <laughs> <laughs> Totoo yun. Alam mo yung tanong na yan, during COVID, naging mahirap. Ang hirap sagutin, no? Hindi mo masabing, okay. <laughs> Ako ah. Oo, oh, hindi mo din pwede masabi, okay, napag-isipan. Dati, napaka-cursory nung, kumusta ka? Okay. Ngayon, pag-iisipan mo talaga. <laughs> Pero marami salamat, send wave. Opo. First press ko nito, after a very long time. Correct, no? Tama po ba? I think you're giving first interview ngayon, but you're on Zoom, no? But this is your first in-person. Yes, oo. I'm... This is familiar territory. You guys are family. I, I do what you do. I used to do what you do. So, uh, I'm fish in water. I know I know this. This is familiar. You're family. I am in familiar territory. I miss you so Thank you, Tito Boy. Thank you. 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 Thank the same team? Yes. So you know what to expect. Boy, last lang. I-push ko lang yung concept na wala ng competition talaga. At this time and age. Every network works with the... Ay, all networks can work together, no? Oo. Oo. I don't know if it's good. Sa totoo lang. Hindi ko alam kung maganda. Kasi magandang trigger ang competition. Kasi competition gives people more choices. Competition uh, allows us to be the best of what we can do and of who we are. So, siguro pahinga ng konti, but I don't know. I don't know if competition, the absence of competition is good. <laughs> Thank you, Tito Thank you. Boy. Thank, Thank you, Send Waves. Thank you, Send Waves. Ito habang na mga mga ding-ding. Pwede na ba yun, yung civil ba? Tito Boy, picture lang. Pang ano? 